treasured venues could soon be history, but a complete teardown and replacement of U.S. Bank Arena would be expensive. Not on your side, Kristen Swilly now joins us live with exactly how steep of a price we're talking about and who's already calling this plan dead on arrival, Kristen. Yeah, well, arena owners say the current plan would cost upwards of $340 million and county commissioners are going to meet about it today, but they already say many of them are a no vote. And this is what the proposed plan would actually look like, what the new design would look like, according to owner Niederlander Entertainment. They say it could look like this and they would actually sell it to uh, to the Port Authority and have the county foot the bill for renovation. We spoke to taxpayers who say they're impressed with the designs, but concerned about cost, especially in the midst of talk about a new stadium for FC Cincinnati and other ongoing projects like Union Terminal. That's why Democratic Hamilton County Commissioner Todd Portune is not on board with the plan. He says it's dead on arrival. Commissioner Chris Monzel agrees, saying it just doesn't make sense. The county already has two stadiums. I, I don't think we need an arena to add to that. It's not a core function of county government to be in the stadium business or the arena business. That meeting does take place today. We'll let you know what they decide. Reporting live, Kristen Swilly, 9 on your side.